Russian shelling has killed at least 15 civilians in the recently liberated Ukrainian city of Kherson, according to local officials. Euronews international correspondent Annalise Borges is in Kherson and sent us this report. This is the site of the latest shelling here in Kherson. As you can see, a residential building in a residential area. Several people have been killed in Kherson over the last few days, and what residents here have been telling us, they didn't experience this kind of random shelling before. When Ukrainian troops were trying to retake Kherson, they say the strikes were more calculated. They only hit military targets. Right now, it's been happening pretty much all over the city. We've heard uh, some workers here trying to repair the cables, even though there's no electricity in Kherson right now, there's no running water, there's no heating. As you can see the crater here, this is where at least part of that artillery fell and pretty much all windows on the other side of that residential building have also been blown up. People say that while they tried really hard to stay put here in Kherson during the days of the occupation, many saying that it was psychologically very difficult for them to do that. They say now things are getting even more difficult because the risk is much more real. As we record this, there are the sounds of explosions that keep roaring in Kherson. This is very much a city on the edge and many of the residents here have been saying that they have no idea where to go to, but that they might have to leave.